I, I told your wife, Billy, I mean, you stop getting the way you are. And I, in what way? The way you are with me. No, treating no, me like no, no, don't treat you like You treat me like yeah, you no, do. don't treat you like you talk down to me and everything. No, no, Are you going to no, take no, that, Michaela? What are you going to say then about Fipsy? What are you saying? No, I want to know better why you was in bed with them strippers mm. when you should have been with me in that hospital. You should have been with me and my little baby boy. Face him. Oh, oh, face him, Michaela. Face him, Michaela. Face him. Face him. You didn't care about us. I didn't know. You didn't care about your wife. You didn't care about me and my little baby. Face him. I'm like facing the course of care. Tell him. You ran me and told me. Told you what? You told me you was in bed with him. Yeah, I'm not lying. And me and my back when I finish what I'm doing. No, I didn't say that. Yeah, you did. I rang you and said I'm in bed with two strippers. I won't let you in. I'll talk to you face to face. Come on. So what are you saying? Yeah, well, why did you do that? Why did you do, do that to me? If you love me, why did you do that? Why do you do all the things you well, do? I don't cheat on you. I, I don't go sleeping with other people. I just want to know now, because I don't want to set this out of... I'm going to leave all this in here. I just want you to be honest, and for the last time, to be honest, and if I ever did find out that you'd been lying, Paul, I'd never forgive you. You've got to tell me, you've got to start talking to me and telling me how you feel. Oh, well done, Mom. Do you know what I mean? Because, oh, you know, I don't need it anymore. Now they had reached a place where they could finally express their real feelings. I was surprised when Michaela requested a private chat with me after the task, and she made a shocking revelation. I, I don't give a shit. If he doesn't have anyone, it's, that's going to be in my brain. I don't want him no more. I don't care who's with him because I don't want to be with him anymore. Mm -hmm. my fo I, I focus on my four kids and my other child that's due to come. Not on what he's going to be gone. As long as he visits my kids and fa financially, you know, does his job with my children, that's all that matters. Mm. I, I don't give a Michaela didn't want to ring back, but there were still two more tasks to go. After working against one another, it was time to learn how to work together. Now, it was time to take a boat trip. Okay guys, so today we're gonna to be going out in canoes. Um, so they're the big green boats, so there's gonna be two of you, so you're gonna be trying to work together. So we're gonna sort of go out, we're gonna try and go for a little bit of a trip down the river, Yeah. Uh, see how far we get. How long's the river? It's a long river, but we won't be going too far. <laughs> Got you dressed up like a pair of lemons. Yeah. yeah. That's now true. you've had your fighting, and now you're going to have a way of working together. You're going to yeah. be teamwork. experiencing teamwork. That's it, exactly. <coughs> Finding out how you can cooperate Without and how them. important it is to work together. When you're paddling and so on, you've got to be really working together because if you aren't, you'll just be going here, there, and everywhere, just yeah. as you have been in your paddling. life. All right. So you ready? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. So the person in the front is like the power, the person at the back is like the captain, and they're going to be steering the boat, telling the person in the front what to do. Go off, come check, no, stay on the other side, please. Whoa! You're doing that on purpose, you! We're going to crash! Stop! And they were useless. Unless they started to work together, they wouldn't achieve anything. Forward! Forward, babe! Yeah! Right, pedal forward now, babe! This side, yeah? Yeah. Finally, with a bit of teamwork, they seem to have cracked it. And working together, they now realise any relationship can be plain sailing. <laughs> like that? Yeah. <laughs> we did well. 
Okay, so you've had one task, one challenge where you was coming together and you was fighting, getting rid of that negativity. Yeah. You've had a task now on the broads where you've been working together and developing some cooperation. Yeah. And so let's take it to the next level where you can have more fun. You up for that? Yeah. Maybe let's go do it. All right. We're up for it. With Michaela still refusing to wear her engagement ring, it was time for their final challenge. This was the last chance to see if they would rekindle their rocky romance. Yeah, so here are. you are today at the fair, some quality time together, having some time together on the ride, having fun together. Are you yeah. up for that? That's yeah. your next challenge. Are you yeah, accepting yeah. it? Yeah. You're accepting it? Good. Yeah, of course. So don't are. blame me if you have fun. <laughs> There were finally signs of progress with Michaela and Paul. They were working together and actually having fun doing it. But with Michaela's engagement ring still in my care, I had one more thing for them to do. It was time for them to confront all their jealousy, anger and hate for one last time. I got them to write down every negative feeling they had ever felt towards one another. It was time to say goodbye to the past. All right, so uh, what have you made of it? You've gone through your challenges. What have you learned from it? Has it been useful? How's it been for you? It's been it's brilliant. Been brilliant. It has been brilliant. The last, the, the last today has just been it's unreal. Been it's changed. I didn't think it'd do anything, basically. I didn't want to come on this challenges. I wasn't going to come on it at the beginning. I've only come on because of Kyla. But I tell you what, I'm glad I came on because it's brought us closer. You remember I took your engagement you ring from you. You, you offered it to me and I took that. Do you want to take it back? Yeah, I do. And what do you want to do with it? We'll let Paul do that. Okay. <laughs> Will you marry me? Do you know it? Yeah. I love you. I love you baby. There's one last Thank thing, you. really, and this is the negative stuff. This is all that jealousy, this is all that paranoia, all the anger. I think this needs to be got needs rid to of, go yeah? To me, yeah? So let's get rid of burn it. Burn it, get rid of it. That's the last of our life, our old life, that. And what's it gonna do now, watch? I'm gonna get it. And that's it. It's gone. Do you wanna help me bury it? Yeah. <laughs> Never see it.